So welcome everyone to Area 41 for the first time in Zurich. We are so happy you made it that early for this opening ceremony that we're going to cut as short as possible because you're all waiting for Halvar, obviously. But uh, we have a few opening words. Uh, we started this conference yesterday with a bang. <laughs> it wasn't our fireworks, it was the Rolling Stones fireworks, but it was still nice to look at. And we started with another bang this morning. Um, you probably noticed that you didn't get coffee at the entrance. That wasn't really our fault because the driver who was you know, dropping off the coffee machines had an accident on the route. But they're here now, so you're all fine. <laughs> and, and it was not a self-driving car, so don't worry. Nobody hacked it. It's fine. Most um, likely. We get to catering later, so maybe let's start with the batches. Do you want to say something about these? Of course. Um, hopefully you all got your batch by now. Otherwise, why are you in here? Um, you saw we gone for the challenge coin, because um, I couldn't make over 350 by hand soldering as we did with the last years. Um, but for those who noticed, they actually blink as well. So there is a button, you can switch it on. The light will last for about 37 hours if you go straight without blinking. If yours doesn't blink, pull the little plastic thingy out of it. If it still does not blink, you might have a faulty one and you can get a exchange one. But well, most likely you just forgot to pull the strip, so uh, be aware of that. Um, we hope you enjoy it. The same goes actually for the t-shirts. Those who have a t-shirt, you can actually collect it upstairs. There's still a few left that you can buy. And you can't see it here by now, but there are some glow-in-the-dark uh, hidden things on the t-shirt as well. So feel free to explore those. Be warned, it's not a kick me sign on the back, so we didn't go for any nasty. It's only a few. At okay. least I think. Let's talk about drinking food because, you know, it's important. Uh, we got a huge shipment of Club Martin, so if you need caffeine, that may, might be something you, you will enjoy. Get it. Upstairs in the catering room, along with, I think we have croissants, muffins, uh, fruit, if that's your thing. So there is a healthy option. Um, we also provide water and uh, do we have anything? The coffee. Well, coffee, yeah, right because now. now we have coffee machines. Uh, we also have a bar open at all times outside, so if you want anything else, you can buy it there. The water is complimentary. Everything else that you find upstairs in the catering room is complimentary. So yeah, enjoy. Do you have anything else for catering? Um, for the lunch, there will be uh, sandwiches served upstairs in the uh, drink and food area as well. So um, hopefully you shouldn't get uh, hungry into the second session on the afternoon. If you're still hungry, there are a few fancy restaurants around. There's even a McDonald's just over there. But we hope there's plenty of food for everyone. So. Just stick around. Did you just call McDonald's a fancy restaurant? <laughs> no, I said fancy restaurant and the McDonald's. Okay, cool. I hope I did. Okay. So that much for drinks and food. Um, we still keep it snappy. If you want to tweet about the event, please do. We appreciate it. Please use the hashtag Area41. If you need something from us, if you have any questions, you're in the city, you're lost, you need to get back to the conference, you can tweet us at A41Con. Um, most of the times we'll answer pretty quickly. If we don't, sorry. We'll, we'll get back to you. Eventually. Oh, yeah, one more point. It's OK to take pictures, but please respect other people's privacy. Ask people before you take a picture. If people don't want to be in your picture, please delete it. Please respect that. I think we're all cool like that, right? OK, cool. Your feedback. Yeah, so we definitely appreciate feedback. So if there's anything you find cool or anything that you think, yeah, could definitely improve, find any of us. And with us, I mean, Stefan, me, and actually Adi, who's over there, just wave at him at the camera. He's making sure that the track one is recorded. The track two underground is not recorded, but we go into that a little later. So with any feedback, find any one of us. Uh, let us know. We want to know. And since we know, all of you are shy. You want to do the anonymous way. So we all handed um, you out some feedback forms. Please do fill, up, fill those out. Make your comments there. Return them by the end of tomorrow, and you got your chance to win a few prizes there through the raffle as well. If you don't want to have your name, just make any nick that we actually can identify you after the raffle. We don't go over the, oh, it's blank. Oh, that was me. We're not falling for that one. So you have to put something there. 
All right. Um, one more thing. I think it, it's not really necessary to say that we don't have a code of conduct on our website. We don't have a you know, no, non-abuse policy posted on our website. With hash days, we never had a single incident reported to the committee for verbal or physical abuse. But we also have a zero tolerance policy. If you feel in any way harassed by another attendee, by a member of the staff, by anyone, please come forward, report it to a volunteer, and we will take care of it. This is important because it has been an issue at a lot of cons lately. We want to make sure everybody is happy, so please just be excellent to each just, other. Just raise it with any one of us or the ones wearing the blue shirts, the helper. They can delegate you to whoever is responsible there as well. We don't have creeper cards, though, so sorry. And when I... <laughs> And please also be excellent to our wonderful hosts here at Complex 457. Yes, they do have a Wi-Fi. No, you don't need to break it. It's fine. We know you can do it. It's OK. They're doing a kick-ass job here, running all the tech. They need to be able to like, no, use the internet and stuff. So please just. Yeah. If you want to use the Wi-Fi, the password is in the booklet. Yeah. And it's we have our own. So use that one instead, exactly. Also, just for logistics, so as you're all aware, you're in room one, so that's the main track. There is a room two. Just follow to your left. There's stairs going down, down, and further down. There's the underground track, uh, which is room two. Those will not be recorded. So those will only be here now, today. So um, if it sounds fancy, go there. You can watch the videos of that one later, but there's, well, other good stuff. Toilets on this area, on the back, on the gallery, so first floor, there's toilets over there as well to your right. And as we already mentioned, there's the food and drinks area with also the sponsors and also the DEF CON booths. So please go there, visit, have your croissant or later the Club Mate to uh, keep you going. And well, I think we come to a few more issues there as well or interesting stuff yeah. like the challenges. Yeah, before we come to the chance, I heard Christian Riley might be dropping O'Day in the underground track, so look out for that. But yeah, challenges. No pressure. So challenges, um, yes, as usual, it's the pleasure of doing some. Um, so go to the website. It's live since uh, this morning. There's four puzzles that you need to solve. Um, I made sure that you can solve it even if you don't have your laptop with you. Well, as long as you can visit this website with your phone. There's stuff like a regular expression crossword that you need to solve. So it should be easy for you guys, right? And the first one to respond and send an email back to me gets a prize. So please do it. Um, if you're bored doing the barbecue, mm, who knows? Barbecue, wonderful. Our segues are so smooth this year. It's fantastic. <laughs> so tonight, after the last talk, We'll have a barbecue, hopefully upstairs on the terrace, which would be wonderful if the weather is nice. If the weather doesn't work out, if it's raining, we'll find a solution. We'll probably make it up here on the gallery. But there is a barbecue. We have salads. We have sausages. We have all the you know, nice stuff you can eat. So uh, stick around for that. After the barbecue, we'll move the whole thing downstairs to the club where the underground track is. And we'll have the, the official area 41 party there. Uh, which is cool because Jörn, who is here in the front row, will be spinning the decks tonight. So please come by, have some drinks with us, and that would be really cool. Maybe one thing more to mention. Um, yes, it's kind of foggy and smoky in here, but that's the smoke machine. It's not because people are smoking, because it's strictly non-smoking inside. So please go outside. There's a smoking area as well, um, or upstairs. Um, a little fresh air is uh, usually healthy as well. So please consider that. Uh, with this, um, obviously, we also want to thank our sponsors, because without the sponsors, it would not be possible to have the Area 41 conference here, providing you with free Club Mate, drinks, free sandwiches, and make it still affordable. So please, thanks for Fortinet, Word Group, Checkpoint, and Dimension Data as our platinum sponsors, followed by the gold sponsors, Joe Security, Tram Micro, Swisscom, and Atrella, who's providing the network. And also the silver sponsors, Kudalska Security, Petray Security, Ernst Young, Kaspersky, and Google. Thanks for the support. 
We hope you um, well, earned it well, and I think it's... Thank you very much. Exactly. Okay, since we are almost out of time, I think it's time to introduce our keynote speaker who is now making his way to stage softly. So, um, Halber actually doesn't need an introduction. He made such notable contributions to reverse engineering and code analysis. Most of you already know him. He was a speaker at Hash Days 2012. Uh, he was actually one of the best reviewed speakers of Hash Days 2012, which is why we asked him back this year to be our keynote speaker. So please give a round of applause for Halber Flake. 